And interestingly enough, it everything has, has dovetailed beautifully in terms of the environmental piece. Three years ago, May 7th, 2012, we watched this film called Forks Over Knives, and it completely switched the way we think about how we're eating, about the environment, and that piece has... Well, it's taken over. I mean, I mean plant-based eating has revolutionized our whole yeah. household, our whole view of ourselves. It, it was the first thing that actually gave me hope about rescuing the biosphere and preventing runaway greenhouse warming. Because I didn't see, I didn't see a government that, that's been hijacked by, by the coal and, and ga oil and gas industry reacting quickly enough. Um, I didn't see the populace who who are being fed so much disinformation from rising up and forcing change from policymakers soon enough, and all of a sudden I realized here's a here's a handy thermostat that we can just turn it all down with. If things get bad enough and people realize it, um, they can they can literally make change immediately. Because carbon dioxide coming out of tailpipes is something that's going to be around for hundreds of years. It's got a half-life, active half-life of, of, you know, 100 years. Methane, only 12 years. And methane is a big component of agricultural, you know, uh, greenhouse gases. So methane ha it can have, it has a, a big warming effect. You know, some people say 25 times, some people say 75 times as CO2, depending on how you parse the timeline. But you can switch it off in 12 years. So that's pretty amazing.